Hi, Amy Roberts here with this week's Climate Corner, and joining me today is Spencer Weisecker, our IT specialist at Climate Realty. And we're going to talk to you today about a feature on our website. So, the Climate Realty website has a sold search, but it also has an active search. So, Spencer, what's the difference between these two? Well, an active search, which is the more common default for home searches online, will search all the active listings in the area based on whatever criteria, how vague or specific you'd like. A sold search, on the other hand, will search homes that have already sold okay. in you know, however far back as you'd like in a specific date range based on those same criteria. Interesting. So for anybody who's looking to sell your house or who's just interested in what your neighbor's house may have sold for if they recently put it on the market, you'll be able to see that data. So if we've got any sellers out there or interested neighbors, how do they do the sold search? Well, it all starts on climate.com, okay. just like the active search. Our tool, our search toolbar is right there on the home page at the top, and above the search button is an advanced search option. Got it. When you go there, you'll have the option between active and sold. We're talking about solds here, so you click that button, mm -hmm. choose your date range and the same criteria that you would have for an active search, and then the results page will show you everything within that specific date range that you search. Awesome. Thanks so much to Spencer for coming out today. Be sure to check out climate.com. See you next time.